Yeah, it's broken. I hit the wall and the tire came right up through the... That'll do it. Call me, let's go. Oh yeah, there's no clutch. Duh. Here we go. 358 Modifieds at Kern County Raceway Park. Official uh, official D-Class Series in iRacing, so that means there's not going to be any cautions in the race. One more lap. Good enough for seventh so far. All right, let me show you guys this awesome pit entrance here. Basically, damn near like a jump. You got to come all the way down to the bottom just to hit it. Pit box in five, three, two, one. They expect right you to hit here. that at 35 miles an hour. Um, I don't know how. I'm not a giant fan of this track with the sprint cars. So far, it's it's actually a lot more fun with these. Because um, it feels like an awkward shaped track where it's it's a little lopsided. The entry to turn one here is a little bit more narrow. Um, that was horse poop. Damn. Sorry about that. Dude, VR is like freaking so awesome, bro. Hell yeah. Got hit up before the race started. Oh. I had that happen to me at Martinsville. Um, somebody just like turned into me. Um, under pace laps. They were warming up their tires, and they, they were warming up their tires, and they just turned right into me. Ten laps down immediately? Yeah. Uh, were they, like, zigzagging side to side, warming up their tires, and just, like, hitting you? Because that's, that's what took me out at Martinsville, when somebody did that to me. Alright man, we're going green next time by. Okay, here right, we go, going green next time by. So, uh, the, just the way this track is kind of awkward, and then like the way the top half of the track is kind of unusable for a good portion of the race. Um, it just, it, it, this track feels, it's kind of awkward, you only use certain parts of the track, it's got a weird shape, it's narrower in one spot than the other. Um, it just feels kind of awkward, and that's, that's actually how a lot of the tracks in the Northeast feel. Because a lot of the tracks in the Northeast were built like. Inside, go high. All clear, all clear. Clear low, clear low. All clear, all clear. Go low. Outside. You're clear high, clear high. A lot of the tracks in the Northeast are like old tracks that used to be horse tracks that were built like, you know, hundreds of years ago before we even had cars. Um, you know, when people were just like using like horses and stuff like that for sport, um, for racing. So, uh, a lot of the tracks in the Northeast, they, they kind of have like an awkward shape to them. And it's like, this track is a lot newer of a track, but they kind of did something similar and they just kind of, you know, threw a dirt track together out in the desert. Um, so like no this 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 track is not symmetrical um the bottom half of the track is like one certain uh has like a certain banking and then once you get to about the middle part of the corner um halfway up the track it like levels off so the whole instead of like progressive banking where the outer edge is is higher it's it's the opposite and it gets flatter as you go up the track um Thirteen point eight five nine. 
Oh, okay. Yeah, it's broken. I hit the wall and the tire came right up through the... That'll do it. Yeah, I, I hit that freaking inside of that corner wrong. That shouldn't be there. No, no, it shouldn't. Um, it's right here. I come off the corner wrong. If you look, I hit these, these, like, these bumps going in. See right here, I hit the bumps, the car starts bouncing a little bit, it gets a little too sideways, and then I overcorrected it. And once you touch the wall, the car wants to climb the wall. Um, wow, it's fixed already? Okay, then. Probably went a few laps down doing that, but um, that's okay. I don't know how they fixed that that quick. Um, I mean, bro, my 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 suspension had to be all sorts of jacked up for that tire to be uh, up here next to me. But somehow they only needed like. 10 seconds to fix it. I don't know what kind of Superman pit crew that is, but uh, whoever my pit crew is, I'm pretty sure all the Cup Series drivers uh, this weekend um, in the championship race at Phoenix are going to want my pit crew. Oh. Yeah, yeah, um, I can definitely feel that there was damage, though. Because the car felt kind of squirrely, and it was still out of control there, even though I left, out, left it out of the gas pedal. It's like, you can catch that pit wall real easy there. If your car gets out of shape at all coming off turn two, you gotta watch out. There's a slick spot forming on entry. Dude, the car just didn't want to go out to the wall there coming off the corner. Had like a weird light feeling in the steering wheel too. When I felt that earlier, that's right before the car kind of like hooked and went back towards the wall and then I'd climb the wall when it came over those bumps and I got a little too sideways. So I didn't want to turn too much. Alright man, 
Good to go. The leader is coming up on you. Do not have fight. I'm struggling. This car is really hurt right now. Ugh. I just said that too. All right, man. Wait till I get the line. Yeah. You got wheel damage. Oh no, I didn't even. I didn't even look down clear. until just now. <laughs> all clear, all clear. Inside, clear low, clear low. Um, but yeah, I'll check. I'll I'll look down a second. I'll look back down in a second here. Now that the race is over. Okay, man. I'm thinking about. Great job, driver. Stop right in front of me. Man, this car is trash. Feels like the rear end is trying to sway side to side All after right, he finishes the race. It. The race is over. That was a really, really Three, rough two, ending. Three, two, we only got a 2x that whole race, I think, which was right really weird. That's it, go. We destroyed this car. Uh, if anybody's watching this on YouTube, thank you guys so much for your support. Fucking love you guys. Hope to see you guys next time. Thank you to all my subscribers, all my viewers, all my followers. Everybody, uh, Texas Speed Sim Racing and uh, iRacing. Thank you, everybody. Fucking love you guys and hope to see you guys next time.